Hi, it's Miss Julie. Today I'm reading you a book about one of my favorite animals. It's called Octopuses 1 to 10 by Ellen Jackson and Robin Page. This book is published by Scholastic. Octopuses like to hide. One is safe and snug inside. Most octopuses live alone. They hide in dark crevices on the ocean floor or in burrows under large rocks. Sometimes an octopus makes a den in a discarded bottle. It can squeeze through an opening as small as a quarter if its beak can fit through. Octopuses have no bones and the beak is the only hard part of its body. Octopuses on patrol use two legs to take a stroll. Octopuses have eight arms. Marine scientists have observed that two of these arms act more like legs. Octopuses sometimes walk across the ocean floor on these two legs or push off with them when swimming. In aquariums, octopuses have been known to climb out of their tanks, walk to another fish tank, and dine on the occupants. Here's an octo oddity. Count each heart. There's one, two, three. They have two brachial hearts and one systemic heart. Octopuses are amazing. They have three hearts, bluish green blood, and the ability to regrow an arm if they lose one. Their tongues are covered with tiny teeth, which they use to scrape a small animal from its shell. The suckers in their arms can grab objects, cling to rocks, and even taste prey. Octopuses in disguise have four ways to fool your eyes. Seals, sharks, dolphins, and whales love to dine on octopus. But octopuses are clever shapeshifters and they have other ways to stay safe. Number one, when threatened, they squirt a cloud of black ink. This confuses the predator while the octopus jets away in the opposite direction. Two, if discovered by a predator, they can change their colors and skin texture to blend in with a rock. Some can even make themselves look like a crab, a seashell, or a flatfish. Three, an octopus can detach one of its arms. The arm wriggles off, sending the predator chasing after it. Four, the octopus can simply disappear into its den until the danger passes. Short and happy, that's their lot. Five years are the most they've got. The giant Pacific octopus lives for five years, but some species only live for six months. Females survive long enough to tend their eggs, cleaning and squirting water over them. Each female releases 100,000 to 500,000 eggs, but few of the hatchlings will make it to adulthood. Six strong arms can help them grab shrimp and lobster, fish and crab. Octopuses catch prey with six of their eight arms. First, they bite the prey with their beak and inject it with a poison. Then they suck or scrape out the meat. Octopuses hunt mostly at night. They can wander where they please swimming through the seven seas. Every ocean of the world from the shallow coastal waters to the depths of the sea is home to at least one species of octopus. They live in the tropics and in the frigid waters of the Arctic and Antarctic. They live in coral reefs and on the sandy ocean floor. The seven seas include the Arctic Ocean, the North Atlantic Ocean, the South Atlantic Ocean, 
the Indian Ocean, the North Pacific Ocean, the South Pacific Ocean, and the Antarctic Ocean. Celebrate and give a cheer on October 8 each year. Since octopuses have eight arms, the prefix octo means eight. October 8th is their special day. The Octopus News Magazine online forum first established October 8th as a day to recognize this amazing animal. World Octopus Day is now celebrated by the National Aquarium in Baltimore the Bristol Aquarium, Scientific American Magazine, and many other aquariums and organizations. Octopuses, they're so fine. You have one brain, they have nine. No wonder octopuses seem so smart. Each octopus arm has a brain of its own, plus one main brain that gives commands to the others. That's right, nine brains. Octopuses can open a jar to get, a, get at a crab inside. They even use tools. Common octopuses will collect small objects and pile them outside their dens to hide the entrance. Veined octopuses carry coconut shell halves to use as a shelter if they're attacked. Here are 10 that you might meet, all with arms and none with feet. The giant Pacific octopus is portrayed throughout this book. This octopus, one of the largest, can recognize individual humans. This octopus has been found in the Atlantic Ocean and off the coast of New Zealand. Males appear to have seven arms, because one is hidden in a sack below their right eye. The orange one here is the blanket octopus, which has webbing between its arms that helps it glide through the surface waters of tropical and subtropical oceans. Its iridescent skin shimmers. Males are 100 times smaller than the females. A female is pictured here. Like many other species, the common octopus can mimic the colors, textures, and patterns of the objects around it. It's found in both tropical and temperate waters of the Atlantic Ocean. The mimic octopus can take on the shape and behavior of more than 15 different sea animals, including a jellyfish, a lionfish, and a stingray. The mimic octopus lives off the coasts of Indonesia and Malaysia. The Dumbo octopus has one paddle-shaped fin on each side of its head-like body. These fins resem resemble the ears of Dumbo, an animated character in a Walt Disney movie. Dumbo octopuses usually live at a depth of 3,000 to 4,000 meters, which is very deep. The blue-ringed octopus of Australia is known as one of the most poisonous marine animals. Its venom can kill a human. The larger Pacific striped octopuses mate face to face and press their beaks and suckers against each other. Found along the Pacific coasts of Panama and Nicaragua, they live in groups of, of up to 40. The veined octopus is found in the tropical waters of the Western Pacific Ocean. It gathers and uses coconuts and shells for shelter. The wolfie is one of the smallest octopuses in the world. Found in the Indo-Pacific Ocean, a full-grown wolfie is only 1.5 centimeters, which is a half inch in length. Octopuses near and far, each an eight-armed superstar. Here are some ways to make an octopus. You can make one out of a banana peel or a toilet paper roll. You can also make an octopus out of an Oreo and some gummy worms. And you can make octopus candy with honey, powdered milk, peanut butter, 
and raisins.